In this video, we're going to take a look at how to make a gauge chart in Excel. For a gauge chart, you need a performance scale and the actual performance. Here, let's first create the performance scale. I'm going to take a five scale variable, bad, poor, okay, good, and excellent. And I'm going to determine the values for these five scales. Bad is going to be the first 20%. Poor, the next 20%, OK, the next 20% and so on. Here, the values must add up to 100. If you want to insert just three scales, you can write, let's say, bad, average and good. You can just give three values that add up to 100. After determining your performance scale, you can enter that and manually enter 100 at the bottom. Now, I'm going to add three more things, value, pointer and end. Value is the actual performance the pointer is the size of the pointer in the gate chart and finally end is just something that we calculate to create our gate chart this is calculated by this formula equal to 200 minus value plus pointer now we have what we need to create the gate chart to create the gate chart select the values from value till 100 Go to insert and click on donut chart. Now a donut chart is created and here delete the chart title and also delete the legend. Now we are going to make this into a semicircle. So we are going to delete the left portion of the donut chart. So double click on the portion of the donut chart that we want to delete. Right click and select format data point. In the format data point window, go to fill and line and in fill, click no fill. Next, go to series options and change the angle of the first slice from 0 to 271. You can also adjust the donut hole size according to your preference. And now select the donut chart. Go to fill in line, here go to border and select no line. Now you can change the color of the gate chart, double click on one segment of the gate chart, go to fill in line and under fill, select solid fill and choose a color that you want. Here I'm going to indicate bad as dark red, poor as a lighter red, ok in yellow, good in light green and excellent in a darker green. Now my gate chart looks good. Now we're going to create a pointer. To create a pointer, click on the chart and under design, click select data. In this window, click on add and here select series name as pointer and the series values as the three values from value to end. Now the pointer series is created, click OK. Now right click the pointer series and select format data series. Go to fill and select no fill. Click the smallest section of the second donut chart that we just created and select solid fill and give a very dark color. This is our pointer. Now we have just one more step to complete the gate chart. Under the design tab, select change chart type. Here, click on the last option which is the combo charts and the cluster column line chart will appear. Here, change the value series to a donut chart and the pointer series to a pie chart. Now uncheck the secondary option for value and tick the pointer secondary axis. Make sure that the secondary axis is unchecked for value series and checked for pointer series and then click OK. Now our gate chart is almost done. We just have the final step to adjust the angle of our gate chart. Right click the chart and select format chart area. Click on chart options and select series value. Here go to series options and change the angle of the first slice from 0 to 271. Do the same for the series pointer. 
now our gate chart is done you can further customize the pointer by clicking on no border you can also change the size of the pointer by adjusting it here if you want a smaller pointer you can give a number smaller than 5 adjust it according to your preference we can also change the direction of the pointer by changing the value since we have a class average of 55 the pointer is at the average zone in yellow if we change it to 75 it will be in the good scale and so on now our gate chart is done all that's left to do is add a chart title and the labels so click on the plus icon on the top right corner of the chart check chart title and also add the data labels click the small arrow at the right of the data labels and select outside end you can customize the data label by going to series pointer data labels go to series options click on label options and you can insert a value from the cells to indicate the label for the pointer here you can click on the value 55 and select ok now this will create the data label for the pointer you can also add chart title for your gate chart and finally we can add the data labels and now my gate chart is done and that is how we create a gate chart in excel